Hey, what's up? Happy Thanksgiving. So in light of this holiday, I figured I would show some people how to make some gravy because I'm a vegetarian, if you know that, and I like mashed potatoes and gravy. So in a lot of times, I don't have vegetarian gravy I can have. So check this out. I'm going to show you how to make some. All right, so the ingredients you're going to need first are you're going to need some butter, you're going to need an onion, and you're going to need some Italian seasoning. So we're going to chop this onion up into pieces. All right, so once the onions are sauteed and browned, what you want to do is get yourself another pot and some vegetable broth. Transfer your onions to the pot. Add Italian seasoning. After this is boiled some, add two cups of water. Alright, so the next step you don't have to do, but I choose to do it. If you like to have onions and things like that in your gravy, leave them in there. I'm using a strainer, so I'm just going to put the strainer in my other pot here, and I'm going to dump this into it. That way I can strain out the solid material. To take equal parts regular all-purpose flour and cornstarch together, so about a quarter cup of each. And we're going to mix this with cold water. Fun fact, don't add cornstarch to hot liquids, it will clump. You always have to add it to cold liquids. And once you have your mixture together and it's all mixed up, what you're gonna do is slowly pour it into your hot liquid that you have and whisk it in as you do, just like this. And stop when it's the consistency you prefer. And this stuff is kind of magic how it happens. So you may need to stir for a second and come back. It works really quickly. Alright, now to my gravy, I add salt and pepper, and since I made so much, it's going to be a little bit, so probably about a tablespoon worth. Do your best guess. Mix that in. Alright, so the last thing to do is to pour it into a jar. And I added a little bit of Italian seasoning to this at the very end. I'll tell you. Thanks for watching.